Welcome back, we have a new update on the way. Rockstar released a few images related to the gun running DLC. I'll run all the images by you and let you know what I think for a good amount of time so you can all take a good look at them. So in this first image we have a truck in the middle, in the center of the image there. It has some nice badass guns on top and we might be able to have a second player on there to operate those guns. So there's the first new vehicle as part of this update. Another big thing you can see in this picture is the Los Santos Air Bunker sign. There will be bunkers available for purchase by every player, and in these bunkers you can store the new vehicles that they release with this update. In this second image here, we see four players at a shooting range having a good old time, just like they do in ammunition, you know, we can do that in ammunition, but now this gun range will be available in the bunkers that I just mentioned that we can buy. You'll have your own gun range in your bunker. If you're enjoying it all and you're getting some good information, please subscribe. I'll keep this channel up to date with as much GTA 5 news as I can. So let's continue. This image is a nice sight. So we have the armored Tampa, which is going to be part of the new update. It's just a spin on the Tampa that we've already had. It looks good. We have guns on top too. They look like mini guns. Maybe they'll let us customize that. Who knows? But I look forward to that as well. This is a fun one as well. This looks like the third official vehicle we will be getting. And from what it says on Rockstar, what they released with the information says that it can be land and water, so it's an all-terrain vehicle. And it has some nice rockets on top, we're going to have to see how those work out in the game. It's going to be exciting either way. And one interesting thing is, in the next image, it shows them in the water. But this one up close that you see here, it doesn't have the same rocket setup on top, so we might be able to change the weapon we have on top, or it's a separate vehicle. It doesn't look like there's too many differences, so I believe we'll be able to change the weapon on top. This last image here is just a character in front of the weaponized Tampa, and this just advertises the gun running business that they're going to be releasing. Just like the Bikers DLC or the CEO work and jobs that you do, there will be equivalent gun running jobs that you can do and a business to create, I'm guessing based out of your bunker. Alright, so the good old gun shop. As we can see in here, look, there's no guns right now, but when we head up here, we still have some gun slots below this uh, pipe wrench here. There's three gun slots. For this update, I assume for sure we're going to at least get one or two new guns. That's got to be a guarantee with the title of the update. But we can see this empty spot here, so that's good news. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Peace.